What's up, Abracadabra? Uh, this is Chakra Zulu, and this particular dissertation is going to step on a lot of toes. And like I say, I might have to break this one up into sub-segments and what have you. Um, recently, I've been talking about, you know, the RBG community uh, following charlatans or whatever. I'm going to take a break from that right now because, again, according to the Divine Channeling, I got to speak on the infamous n-word the n-word is not a bad thing the n-word is your friend and i'm gonna tell you why because of where it comes from a lot of black people are sensitive to what the word means a lot of black people from the civil rights generation and even before that you know who lived during segregation and whatnot are sensitive to that word because of how the oppressor bastardized the word in terms of referring to us with it. And I got to break it down like this. This is as simply as I can break it down. First of all, uh, the word nigger means God. You know, um, all you black people that don't agree, fuck you. And I'm going to tell you why it's fuck you. Because you don't know your history. And then even if you were exposed to your history. And even if you were shown the facts. You know. You, you still reject it. Because you still caught up in your feelings. About how white people made you feel. About how they use the word nigga. Because they say it with such contempt. You know. They know how emotional your black ass is. And they know how to let it get under your skin. And so they can use that against you. Alright. There's power. In word sounds, it's called etymology. Okay, it's all about applying the power of a word and making it into a certain reality. You got white people who are campaigning for black people to stop using the word nigga. Why is that? I'm going to get to that in a second. But see, again, the word nigga means God. Yeah, it comes from nigu and naga. Nigu mean for the male version and naga for the female or whatever but it's the same difference you have different variations of the word and black people get caught up in putting things in a box and saying that oh well it, it was only one way or another no it was several variations that all meant the same damn thing all right uh um when white people use the word against us, it's just like this. You know how you go into a retail establishment and say either you're being difficult with the person helping you behind the counter or the person behind the counter insists on being an asshole or a bitch about it or whatever and they start referring to you as sir or ma'am but they say it with a contempt in their tone. That's the same thing with nigger. You know what I'm saying? When they're calling you a nigger, they're letting you know that you are God. And they know that you are God above them. And so when they use it in that contemptuous tone, you know, again, they want to use it against you to make you feel like, make you feel fucked up about being a God above them when really the problem is with them. They're, they're the ones who, who can't deal with it. You know what I'm saying? It, 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 but they can use it against you because they know that you don't know your history behind the word. You know you know your history behind it. They can't use it against you in that sense. You can throw it out at them and make them feel uncomfortable. That's what I'm getting to about the whole thing with white people wanting you to stop using the word because it activates your kundalini. And when your kundalini is activated, you know, your pineal gland and your crown chakra are stimulated, which puts you on a higher spiritual plane. Which puts you on that higher frequency where you can uh, achieve godlike power. You know, to where the the mundane pedestrian things that happen on this planet, especially in this country, uh, you tend to not be affected by. Not only are you not affected by it, you have the juice to do something about it, at least within your own circle. Okay, why would white people give a damn about black people calling each other niggas? You know what I'm saying? But see, that word is killing them spiritually. You see what I'm saying? Because anytime my kundalini is activated, that works against them. You know, and I'm sorry, white people, you know, whether you're racist or not, whether you're part of the elite or not, 
or whatever, it, it all works the same or whatever. To the white people who aren't racist, to the white people who know the truth and, and who know the deal and whatever, whatever, I salute you. You know, um, all I'm doing is stating facts right now. So no need to get all, you know, hintsy with me because all I'm doing is, you know, sending a message out. Like I said, this is really more for black people to get out of their feelings than it is to be clowning white folks. You know, so... Uh, uh, all you black people out there that are tripping on the N-word and whatever, whatever, stop tripping on it. You need to start using it. You need to start utilizing it because you get in touch with your spiritual power that way. That That's the power behind it. the N-word. Doesn't matter if it's N-I-G-G-R, N-I-G-G-A, N-I-G-G-U-H, however you want to spell it because it's just the same as Negus and Nagas and N-G-U and, and, you know, Netter. You know what I'm saying? Netter, nigger, netter, nigger. How are they not the same? You know, but you got fake ass niggas in the RBG community be like, no, that's a. I done had motherfuckers on Facebook who I done had to delete who who they want to shout this uh, pow raw and raw loot shit and everything else and whatever. They want to be all Egyptolo Egyptological with the shit, you know, and then when you try to school them on this, they want to say, oh, no, the word nigger is a, is a, uh, a GMO, a GMO. Uh, uh, word is is genetically engineered or artificially engineered word that white folks took and bastardized because we negus we nagas and, and whatever whatever shut the fuck up you sound simple you know and, and I had to cut a couple of people off because they 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 be like oh no you know that's their version no it's not I mean even if it is their version again they're still referring to you as God. You know, why the fuck you can't see that? Because you still caught up in some emotionality, you know, left over from the goddamn 1960s, you know? I mean, come on, man. And and I done said it before, that, that civil rights movement was a motherfucking scam, you know? I'm going to tell you why it was a motherfucker. No, 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 I'm going to save that. I'm going to save that. I'm going to get you in the next dissertation with that. I'm going to cut this off. Abracadabra.